Hey guys, for today's look, I made this look right here for a holiday. This is like a glam holiday look, makeup look. So if you're interested in how I got this look, then please keep on watching. Well, I already have my eyebrows on. As you can see, I did them off camera. And I also have um, some concealer under my eyebrows to, to find them a little bit more. So now what I'm going to do is apply the... I'm going to apply some primer. This Matchbox Photo Finish Lid Primer in Medium. So I'm just going to go ahead and apply that to my eyelids before applying any eyeshadow. And this will make my eyeshadow last longer and... So I'm just going to apply it on my lid wherever I'm going to apply eyeshadow. And now I'm just going to tap this softly onto my eyelids. Right. So if you're curious to see how the little primer, eyeshadow primer tube looks like, this is how it looks like. And I also will apply and I and also I will supply I will link the um where the website where I got it and got at Sephora. So I'll just all the products that I use for this video I will um provide them down below in the description box so if you're curious just take a look down below on the little box to see where I got them how much it costs so after eyeshadow primer I'm gonna go ahead and apply my eyeshadow and for this look I'm gonna use the Naked Urban Decay heat palette That's how it looks like don't mind the mirror very dirty <clears throat> and it does come with a little um eyeshadow dual eyeshadow brush but I'm not going to use it for this video. Before I get into the palette I'm going to go ahead and apply Wen Wild Mega Glow Contouring but this side of it I'm going to use to apply the powder I'm going to use this large blending brush. I'm just going to apply this all over my lid. I'm used to setting my primers with a setting powder so. So first I'm going to use Sauced and we use the same large blending brush since this is my decision shade. I'm going to apply it everywhere on my lid, across my lid, focusing in my inner eye and outer eye, my crease, mostly everywhere. Now I'm gonna apply low blows next to Sauced. Use this one. I'm gonna apply it with Morphe M124 um, eyeshadow brush, and I'm just gonna pack this in to my crease. Clean it off with the back of my hand, and I'm just going to mix these two together, blend them together. You wouldn't want any streaks. Okay, and now you, re you really want to, you don't want to ne neglect the outer part either. It's going to pull your look together. You just want to blend upwards like this. Now going in with the, my eyeshadow palette from the Druvia's Place, or Druvia, yeah, Druvia's Place. A freak by Juvia's, whatever. I'm gonna use this Cameroon brown, very rich brown color, and I'm gonna use the same Morphe brush. And I'm just gonna apply this on my outer V area, my V, my crease, and my lid. I'm gonna pack this on. So I'm just gonna use a smaller blending brush, and this is by this is a drugstore. Just any smaller blending brush will work. Right? 
blend this in as long as you don't have any streaks. I'm going to use the same one to apply sauce on top of that color, on top of the Cameroon color, only on this, like on my eyebrow bone, sort of. Then outside of Cameroon, you know what I'm saying, like, like this, just around Cameroon color. Here my eyebrow bone as well. I'm going to use the same smaller blending brush and I'm going to use Blow Blow and I'm going to apply that on my um, this part of my lid, the center. I'm going to deepen the outer eye with ashes in the outer V. I'm just gonna blend ashes to my lid. Now I'm gonna apply this color of Bento. I'm just gonna apply on my center. Again, I'm going to use this um, brush from the drugstore. Drug it's a very small, detailed brush. And I'm going to use Bar Too Faced Born This Way Concealer. Apply some concealer on there. I don't have that much anymore. So you're going to focus on the outs in the inner corner. The tear duct region. The trick is just to go slow and take your time. I just want to wait for it to dry up. You want to keep it close. We're gonna set the concealer, and I'm gonna be using Chaser from the Urban Decay Naked Heat Palette, and I'm just gonna use this large one, large blending brush, just to set that concealer. I'm gonna be using this Wan Wild P10 um, pencil brush, and I'm gonna apply Low Blow. Right here. Just so it'll have a little bit more of a definition. Like that. Okay. Um, and now we're going to be using this Inglot 22T concealer brush. And I'm going to spray the brush with um, Flower Seal the Dio Long Lasting Setting Spray. That finish. And I'm just going to be spraying it. And I'm going to apply Lombre from the Naked um, on top of the concealer, but just like this part. So we're going to apply Lombre, we're um, covering up the concealer, where we apply the concealer. That's where we're going to apply the shade Ombre. And I'm just going to be patting it very softly. 
to make it pop a little bit more, we're going to apply I also apply, I also sprayed my brush with the setting spray again, the same one. Applied, I have sprayed it before, before I applied this color, Coffee, from the um, A Freak by Juvia's Place palette. Same method, I'm, I just, I'm just applying it, I'm just patting it in. Okay, I'm going to be using the MUA Professionals crease 315 brush this gonna be a little crease brush and I'm gonna apply quince from the urban decay palette and apply that onto my eyebrow bone now I'm gonna use this drugstore I found this in the drugstore this is a felt tip Super cat skinny um, black eyeliner, very fine felt tip. Keep it as close to your lash line as possible. I haven't mastered applying the wing on camera yet so I'm gonna do that be right back all right so I already did this eye off camera and I went ahead and did my foundation routine if you're interested you can take a look at my other uh, videos that I will actually I'm gonna link it link it right here at the corner of the video you can uh, click on that to watch how I do my foundation routine what primer I use what foundation what um well actually right now I'm setting my concealer um, under my eyes, I applied the Maybelline something. Oh, yeah, Maybelline Instant Age Rewind Eraser Concealer. So now I'm setting it with this Crown Cosmetics um, brush, and I'm using this Wine Wild Contouring Palette. I'm using this guy right here to set in my concealer and my foundation. Just like panning motions, really, just like so, around my mouth, my nose, so you won't have any creasing throughout your day. Just pat, pat, pat. Oh, my neck also. Which I'm gonna turn you guys out. So once I set that in. And I also apply concealer and I, of course, set my concealer with the powder that I was using right here. That's what I was doing. I was just setting that concealer. Now I'm going to go in with the palette. Zoom you guys in. And I'm going to apply, use this pencil brush, the Wet Wild pencil brush. And I'm going to go in. Apply low blow from the Naked Heat from the Urban Decay uh, Naked Naked Heat palette, and I apply uh, low blow on my lash line, and also apply, not my lash line, but my lower this region right here, and all over it. And I also applied an Fuego on the outer line just to um, darken it up. I use this one. Surprise! I took my eyebrow my eyebrows off I took my braids off okay so now I'm going to apply I'm gonna contour a little bit I'm gonna use the same thing the same palette I've been using for my powder setting my concealer I'm gonna use the just uh, to apply some contour I'm gonna apply I'm gonna use the wet and wild mega glow contouring palette I'm gonna use this elf brush use that much Blend that contour in a little bit. Using this large blending brush. I think this is from Beauty 360. Okay, I'm gonna go 
contour my forehead. Oops. I'm going to apply mascara. This is by Maybelline. This is a voluminous super star fiber. Sorry, this is not by Maybelline. It's by L'Oreal. <laughs> step one, step two, and we step one. Now I'm going to apply some blush. I'm going to use a Mega Glow. No, it's called the LA Girl Blush Collection, blush collection and Glow Palette. I'm going to use um, these two right here. Brush from the drugstore also. Dab it a little bit. Just to give some color back to my cheeks. This top row right here. Of course, I'm gonna use my favorite highlighter brush. This is by Bare Minerals Cross, like this. You see? Cupid's bow, I'm gonna use my finger. I mean, my Cupid's bow, my nose braid. This is my Cupid's bow. I'm going to apply LA Girl Lip Liner. This is a natural. It's GP, GP5112. Yeah. This is Provocalypse by Rumble London. This is like 16 hour wear. This is the first um, step and the sec part, second part was to lock it in. It's just a very clear. It's like a clear coat. Okay, so once that's just finished drying up, I'm going to apply some more setting spray. The flower seal the deal long lasting setting spray. Okay, I think it's dry enough. I'm gonna apply infallible eight hour pro, pro gloss by L'Oreal Paris. I'm gonna apply Maybelline New York Unstop Unstoppable Eyeliner. Just missing something. And we're gonna apply this on my waterline. My upper waterline. And my lower waterline as well. I'm gonna mainly focus right here my outer tear duct region. So this is it for the video. I hope you guys like it. Please give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel.